Hi everybody, it's Kelly Driver here. Welcome to my art channel. It's wonderful to have you here with me today. In the video that I'm doing for you today, I've got a round canvas, uh, a round timber board, and um, I'm going to use some, um, a leftover paint color that I've got and some black and other colors in it to create a lovely um, acrylic pour, Dutch pour on the um, round timber board. So uh, let's, let's see how we go with that one today and um, have some fun. Right, here we are. So this is a 40 centimeter wooden board. And I'm going to do a black base with some, um, this left, this paint is left over and it's got a bit of, um, it's going to have some uh, pearl colours in it. And I'm just going to spread that out. Oxide black, this is. Okay, so the plan is, is I'm going to do a, a blowout up this way and a blowout up this way. I'm gonna do a, like a stripe in the middle here. So we're first of all, we're starting with um, pearl white. I might do it just vertical and then on the wall, it won't be, I don't think it'll be vertical, but I'll do just a straight up and down stripe here. So I thought I'd do a pearl white stripe rather than white. So we'll see what happens doing that. Now this is a mixed up dusty gray blue kind of color, bit of a Hamptons feel kind of blue this one. gray and I have ultramarine violet light pearl blue did I close that oh closed it <laughs> Brilliant blue. And light gold. Now I'm not going to um, flood around the uh, paint today. I'm not gonna flood it out just going to blow it out from, from here. After I torch the bubbles, of course. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. <laughs> the colors are gorgeous.
beautiful. Yeah, I'm really happy with this. I'm going to um, leave it to dry. Okay, so I've decided I'm going to put a bold gold line down the center of my artwork. I'd have a steady hand for this. I could do this with a Posca pen, but um, I like this gold more than Posca gold. I just love that when I do these kinds of things that the only thing that limits me is my own imagination. And I can do whatever on earth I want to do on this painting to think, to make it more aesthetically pleasing for myself um, and what I love, hoping that other people will love my work too. I'm loving it already. So I'm using a um, double zero brush here. So not that fine. I have much finer brushes. Well, that's cool. Oh, I'm so glad I made this change. Okay, everyone, here is the final result. So beautiful. I have put it on the table to record this final video because the shine from the epoxy resin is so stunning that it's bringing up um, my lights and um, the what's outside my window. <laughs> it's just like, um, it is so shiny. It's just stunning. So very pleased with how my epoxy resin has um, on this, this the coat of epoxy resin is just stunning it's worked perfectly very happy about that and the uh, gold breakthrough line is just gorgeous so I'm sure you can appreciate how beautiful this is and um, how shiny so shiny it's virtually impossible not to get the video camera or my light <laughs> the ceiling light in the video but thank you very much for watching everybody i'm so excited to be able to come and do another acrylic pour for you um, the last few videos have been stencils and now i'm desperate to do another acrylic pour as beautiful as this one so stay tuned and i will see you soon bye for now